Hello and welcome to the next episode of Resident Evil Deadly Silence and today we continue on as Chris as we open room 002. And we'll do a tactical reload there, uh, just to make sure we've got ammo in the den. First things first, uh, this is a trip to the bathroom. And then so grab these handgun bullets in the sink. My handgun bullets is always good. Okay, now we've got them. We've got other things in here, like a zombo and a spider. Handgun sufficient to deal with the spider. We really need to clear it out the room because uh, we need to do stuff in here. And this room is very, very uh, tiny and with hardly any maneuvering space. And uh, watch out for that spider. He, well, I can say she because if you kill it a certain way, it releases babies. Uh, we'll spit venom at you and poison you, although it should be venom. We're not going to get into that today. Okay, now we've got the Plant 42 report. We can look in this desk. We've got a small key. It's a small key. It's a small key. It's a small key. Only used it once and it vanishes forever. Into the ether. So who knows where that goes. Okay, let's get the map for the dormitory. And that just fills in all the areas we haven't investigated yet. And now time to make a quick trick. Back to the item box because we're gonna need a blue herb. Yes, uh, make sure you, before going down there, grab a blue herb because um, you will be poisoned in this version of the game. And no, uh, it's not something you can really dodge. Okay. That, that's heavily headed it because you just saw the tail end of that, and uh, I just showed off what equipment I had as well. Let us go into the depths. But first, it's like a nice zombie attack. Oh, nice move. Right. And we got uh, pause troubles because we got bit too many times. Let's uh, top off ourselves. Okay, our next thing is downstairs. And I don't know why there's no music in the hallway. Just, just stay there, quiet, no music. Okay, time for Chris to go downstairs, these ladders. And there's a lot of spiders down here. And there's a wasp, but I killed that um, because I pushed one of these boxes in the wrong place had to reset. But the wasp was already dead. But you get to watch me push the other boxes into the water. And every time you go back up them stairs, these spiders respawn. Pain in the backside here. Not because they're dangerous, they just like stun you every so often. And the box squished that one. <laughs> nice. And uh, yeah, th that's where I uh, originally messed up, so that's why the spiders flat pad from the front. <laughs> Push, 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 push with all your strength. Push that box to the end of the road. Yeah, them spiders are in the wrong place. Hey, hey. That makes a nice little bridge. I thought now we could have just jumped across that with them two other boxes or 
swam across it. And there's some herbs there. Run back and grab. Oh no, my inventory is full. What shall I do? Combine. Make right, that a stronger heal. And we'll grab this one. And we'll top off as health while we're at it. There we go. Okay. Into the water you go, Chris. And there are sharks in here. Yes. Okay, uh, forget you saw that. <laughs> yeah, that was just to show off the sharks. For some reason, though, the uh, cutscene doesn't trigger here. I don't know why. Okay, um... Now, here's why you've gone to need the poison cure. Now, this can take a few attempts if you're trying to uh, play on the uh, melons or anything else. So, because it's really difficult to turn this wheel. Yep, sprinklers have been activated, and the water's changing colour. It's poisonous! Don't drink it then, Chris. Okay. Yep, so all we got to do is turn this wheel and uh, close off the valve. Use the power. Turn it! Turn it! Yay. Right. Oh, when I tried this with you, it took me off bloody ever. But with Chris, I got this in one day. Although it did slip back a few times, but... Oh well, what are you gonna do? And there we go. Now the water's draining. I don't know where it's draining to. Now, this is where you use your poison cure to get back to max health where we are. And now we're gonna do a little number puzzle. I'll skip to the solution so you guys don't have to watch me mess about trying to do math. There we go. We'll go in here, we'll get some ammunition and a key. Which is good, because we can always use more bullets. Especially for what's coming up soon. Yes, pick it up. I don't know why I was for so long looking at these and gun bullets. I was just mesmerised by them. Yeah, there we go. Get some shotgun rounds here as well, which is good because Chris needs a lot of them. Once Chris gets the shotty rounds, he is happy. Does his little uh, victory dance, and then he gets some a uh, key. Now everything in the basement's done with, except for them sharks floundering there. Let's put them out of the misery because they haven't got any water to swim in and they'll probably suffocate you. We ended there paying those poor abominations. They're victims too if you think about it. They wasn't asked to be experimented on, but Umbrella experimented on them anyway. Yep, and there's bloody spiders about. I don't know where they keep coming from as we ascend back into the mansion. Well, not the mansion, the dogs. Yes, we're almost uh, done with this part of the game. I oh, know there's some herbs back there, I'll grab them later. But first, let's use some items up. Now 
and we can get rid of that. Now we've got two spots. And we get another stab the zombies. One last bathroom to explore, and uh, that guy's a whole head shorter. And this guy will go down to the knife. And we get some bullets for scribble. More handgun bullets. Uh, yeah, we've got quite a good few amount of them. They'll come in handy later. Because I need to... Ammo manage. So the shotgun's gonna be very important, but I don't wanna be using it against insignificant enemies like zombies. I like to use the handgun for them. And that's about V Joel, which we will not be using this on this run. Now, now we've cleared up some space, I believe I go back and get the herbs. We're gonna need some healing. Uh, in that desk, that slot, there's just an ink ribbon. Uh, you probably have tons of them by now if you're playing normally. So I advise just skipping it. Because the other two have shotgun rounds and shotgun rounds are more important. And I came back here because I remembered oh, there was a herb here as well. So I'd eat this one and um, pop off my health. And then uh, we'll go back and... Um, Yeah, for some reason. Okay. There we go. Right, we're about ready to fight Plant 42. So we'll come back here and grab these herbs now, I suppose. And so we've got healing options in the fight. And uh, it's best not to leave them. Because we are already. And there we go. Now it's time to fight the boss. And we can be almost done with this place because, as you know from Jill's run, uh, there's a surprise in here later on. But for now, we've got to do some weed whacking. And what a weed that is! Grab Chris. Oh, Chris. Ow. Oh. Okay, Chris, don't take that nonsense off the plan. Show him who's boss. Yeah, plan one two isn't a particular hard Oh. But it does have two rounds. And because we told Rebecca to stay, she's not going to interfere in this fight. Uh, Chris has to do this the old fashioned way. And that one missed. What the plant's done for. Take that plant. Chris has shown his gardening skills and his deadly to all plants. Right, and I'm stuck on the scenery. And we get the final mansion key so we can open up the last few doors in there. I'll just eat that herb to top off my health. So we took a few hits. And I'll make my way back to the mansion. 
gunshots. What's going on? Those men are this. Wesker! Chris, you're alive. My words exactly. Where's Jill? Aren't you with Jill? I'm sorry. We were attacked by a strange monster. I lost track of her while we were scouting around. I hope she's okay. I see. Well, it's not your fault. This place is crazy. If we stay here, all of us will end up dead. What should we do, Wesker? We have to complete this mission. Whether we escape or stay and look for Jill, we don't have many bullets left, and we can't even protect ourselves. We're still in trouble. Chris, there are a lot of locked rooms in that house. Check them out one more time. There must be a place to hide safely. I'll look around the house a little more. Okay. Let's get going. Oh well. Looks like Wesker was fighting the bees. And he was hitting them more successfully than I can. They were nice to hit with a gun, so yeah. One last trip to the item box. And uh, as you noticed, the dogs that didn't finish off out here have now been removed. Because you normally get a cutscene here uh, where Richard's trying to contact you. But since we haven't got a radio, that ain't gonna happen. There's no point fighting him. You can just uh, bypass him by cleverly running around him. And we're making our way back to the main mansion. And how that so running to go for a nice swipe, I don't know. And the spiders, they're back. Let's ah. still get a hit on it. Ah. Ah. Alright, there's some herbs here. So we're gonna have to get um in a specific order to grab them all. Examine these beforehand to know which were which. Because <laughs> it tells me so. This helps me plan out the order I need to pick them up in. And that generic dog sound, that's good. And we can grab the last one. And check out another spider while we're at it. Because they'll be back. They're always back. I'm doing my day. Their spidery ways. I don't move that back. Who knows? Ooh. 
Ooh, what is he? Some that most people don't normally see. What? It must be a star's radio. It's a little bit broken, but it might still be usable. I'll take it with me. And they are introduced to a new enemy. The hunters. What, what are they? Monsters? And yeah, yeah. Rebecca! Is she now, still in the house? We don't have much time. We've got to find Rebecca. Now I was thinking she's in the upstairs library. Oh, that's a different version of this game, so. I'm just going to be on this getting in the way, trying to impede our progress. Then I think, wait a minute, there should be seven shotgun rounds in there, I'm going to grab them. I'll leave the other ammo because I'll definitely be back here later. Okay, Chris, you don't have much time. Now I'll look at the note. This time it's been written by Wesker. Uh, there's a hunter and a zombie up here. Take out the enemy. Right? Okay, and we'll clear this zombie for later, so we can have I know I'm using a shotgun round on a zombie, but. I don't have much of a choice. I just need to clear these enemies. Oh. Yeah, this is like I ran in the library. Rebecca should be in here, but no. Just a hunter. I didn't have to kill that hunter, but oh well. I thought, oh no, has he killed Rebecca already? So this was a little bit waste of time, but don't worry, we've still got time. Another hunter around the corner. Somewhere. I think he has a spike in that Ah, yeah, he does the get. And there I make another mistake because I'm starting to panic. I don't even know where Brad was. Oh, Richard, sorry. Run, Chris, run! You've only got so much time. And the quickest way to get Rebecca is over the top. It brings you down on the right side of the mansion. And there's like four hunters out here. And, and I take a few hits. organize a search for the others and get the hell out of here. Understood? Yes, sir! Oh, 
Okay, I'll go first. Proceed with your own judgment. All right, can you do it? Yes, I That's can! Better, better. Good luck. And on that note, I'm going to call it an episode. Have a good day, everyone. Bye!